how that happens in a car dean. No. <laughs> I'm not sure which I prefer. Des yeah. What, descending in the car or descending on your bike? Oh, I'm not a great descender in either. <laughs> <laughs> So hello, welcome back to another video. We have driven down from Andermatt this morning, down to Altdorf. Um, we are on the edge of Lake Lucerne. We decided to go for a cycle around this lake at a lower level. It was easier to get to this lake than it was into Larkin, but it's still gonna be a nice, beautiful flat ride with some stunning scenery. Um, we buy the massive gramophone if anybody knows the area. But yeah, this looks amazing. We're gonna enjoy this ride today. It's 31 degrees. It's absolutely baking down here. Obviously we've been up at altitude um, I don't quite know where we are, must be at least a thousand metres down from where we have been. But another exciting day in Switzerland. That water looks so blue, Dean, it looks incredible. It looks nice from here. Oh, a nice ride round here. If we find the others. If we find the others, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we've lost Steve and Pete. We've told them to meet us by the gramophone. They reckon they're parked in the same car park as us and we can't see them anywhere. Um, Charles has stayed at home for a nice sauna because he's got two days riding to get home to Basel Airport to fly home. So uh, he's already done four days more cycling than we have. So hopefully we can find a cafe somewhere and have a nice leisurely spin without going up any bloody stupid mountains. <laughs> What a bike path this is, by the way. Running all the side, around the side of the lake. Stunning views. Oh, we've got a headwind out. So I'm hoping we've got a tailwind back as well. Beautiful. Steve, what did you have in your protein shake last night, chasing after that e-bike? <laughs> I should have got straight on his wheel, not giving him a 20, 50-yard gap. I love the way he was just sat up straight, pedalling at about 40k an hour. Yeah. He was doing more than that. But look at that. I was doing 25 and I couldn't catch it. This is the ferry crossing. Yeah, parts of that bike path were absolutely outstanding. Some of it was a little bit scary because it was quite a narrow pavement right next to a main road. And we went into one tunnel and there was a lorry coming out through the tunnel and we weren't very far away from the lorry. <laughs> Just a little bit of a squeaky bum time. But no, what a beautiful place this is. And we're down to now, I think about 450 meters above sea level. So yeah, a lot, a lot better air. But it's baking, it's absolutely baking.
ticket, Steve, doesn't it? Sea view, refreshments and shade. When I say sea view, I mean lake view. <laughs> what are you thinking? Hot drink, cold drink, or both? Also, many drinks at the moment. I've pretty much drunk two water bottles already. Yeah. 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 It's very warm as well in the bottles now, isn't it? It hasn't has been going that hot at the top of the mountains. I fancy some ice cream or a nickel block of glory or something. Some disgusting calorie pudding. Yeah, that one. Thank you very much. That looks amazing. Where's your banana split? Banana split. Oh, look at that, Peter. <laughs> None of us know what we've ordered, but it tastes good. We still can't work out what it is. <laughs> what do you reckon it is? It's, it's not vanilla, is it? But oh, it's hitting the spot. So you just can have a nice little nap and ponder the 12 quid you've just spent on an ice cream. <laughs> Don't give the game away, I must have spent. <laughs> Let's not mention the Coke as well then. <laughs> that was a big Coke. Yes. <laughs> it's probably £15 for the Coke. <laughs> Beans on toast tonight. Right, so we've done 28k, so we've got another 28k back to the car in Altdorf. And then we'll drive home. What a stunning day to ride a bike. Who's going to go for a paddle then? I just dipped my hand in there. It's, it's not cold, but it ain't that warm. Don't fall in. <laughs> well, you know how to feel, Steve? You said it seemed refreshing earlier. Sorry? You said it seemed refreshing earlier. You're not going to have a paddle? You need to sleep. Right, so that's day four done. A little ride around Lake Lucerne. We're in Flulen, not Outdorf. Outdorf was apparently a little bit over there. So that's where we were supposed to start. We started in Flulen, so we're back in Flulen. Uh, yeah. <laughs> nice expensive ice cream. Nice way to spend the day. We're going to go back, get showered, watch the tour, have some lunch, and get prepared for some big mountains tomorrow. We're not quite sure what to do yet. Um, I'm thinking of the Firk of both sides and the Grimpsville Pass. But we've just seen a sign for the Clausen Pass, so we're going to look that up, see where that is. That could be another option. But yeah, feet are getting sore, and I haven't actually done that much mileage. <laughs> but it's nice to feel good again. So we will see you tomorrow for more shenanigans in Switzerland. So what I want to hang with my friends, so what I want to do.